All right, so you might be surprised to know that most of us here at WBOC News spend much of our workday writing. That's right, folks. We don't just wing it. Nearly every word <laughs> of the broadcast is written before it's ever spoken. That even applies to Charlie. Well, there is good news for people who write for a living, as Charlie tells us in tonight's cutting-edge, high-tech edition of Travels with Charlie. Ever since we humans started writing thousands of years ago, we've searched for ways to make the process easier. Clay gave way to wax and wax to paper, hands to typewriters, typewriters to word processors, and now we have a new incarnation, the writing assistant. And that's what you're seeing here. This is the text editor on an iPhone 5S with writing assistant enabled. Now between the keyboard below and the copy above is a gray line with three sections. In each is the assistant's guess about what your next word will be. It's an extremely interesting experience because it's every writer's dream to have someone, even a program, hanging on their every word. The suggestions can become fascinating if you start paying attention to them because one word can lead a writer in a whole different direction. While that could be a problem, the writing assistant offers one tremendous advantage. How long does it take you to type out the words, tremendous advantage? Or supercilious, or ostentatious? A whole lot longer than that, I'd expect. Someday this program might argue with you about what you're writing, or maybe change it when you're not looking, or maybe it'll call the cops. Until then, I'm just glad to know that I've spelled the gastronomically distressed hippopotamus eschewed the bananas correctly. Indubitably elucidated, this is Charles Paparella for WBOC News. <laughs> Writing assistants called predictive text on most smartphones will actually learn things like your name and words that you commonly type. Pretty amazing stuff. It is.